Hey, today I want to show you how to repair your uh, a mop ringer. It's a heavy duty mop ringer, but it has a little problem. And it happens every now and then, but I figured out a way to, to work around it and fix it totally. So this is uh, the mop ringer. And every now and then this, uh, this side pops loose and then you can see it's not as, it still will work, but not as good. And this piece always ends up falling out. You can see it goes inside, uh, on the inside like that, you can see there's two keys that go into these keyways. So I'm gonna loosen this nut a little bit and put it back in there. I figured out a way to make it stay in permanently. So first I'll get this, uh, I don't know what you call this thing, it's kind of like a guide. Get that thing to go back in there. Okay, I got that piece in and then you can see this kind of, this tube kind of has a little too much play in it. It can easily pop out again if you put a lot of force on it. But I'm getting ready to show you how to solve that right now. I'll put this nut back on. I thought about welding uh, something right here, but I was worried that the heat might hurt the plastic. So next best thing, I'm gonna use a, uh, this worm clamp here. I'm gonna put this worm clamp on it, or band clamp. And I'm going to rely on this surface here to rub against this inside and keep it from uh, walking out again. I'm going to get it kind of close to snug and then I'm going to remove as much of the uh, play in it as possible. And since it's traveling in this direction here, I want the big end uh, where it's going to be rubbing the most to be in the strongest part. So I'll get it tight, I'll get it kind of tight here and then then I'm going to push it in as far as I can get it and move the clamp over and take out as much of the play as I can and tighten that firmly. Now there is a little play here, but I think once I tighten this nut up, it'll remove that. Oh yeah, zero play now. So there you go, that's how you would fix your uh, your mop ringer. If you happen to have one of these and it giving you that problem, you can just put a band clamp right here and remove the play. Looks like I could actually do a little more. I think I'm gonna actually uh, take a little more of the play out. There you go. I think that'll work. Well, thanks for watching and uh, good luck with your projects.